Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to help you to determine the Lewis structure of HSO4- ion. It is formed when sulfuric acid reacts with water and the chemical compounds that contain HSO4- ion are known as hydrogen sulfates. Let us see the Lewis structure. For that, let us count the total number of valence electrons. We have one hydrogen atom having one valence electron, one sulfur atom having six valence electrons and four oxygen atoms having six valence electrons. Now that gives us a total of 32 valence electrons. Now let us see the arrangement of atoms. For that, we will place sulfur atom in the center and place four oxygen atoms around it somewhat like this. Also, hydrogen sulfate is an example of oxygen ion of sulfur. And whenever we see hydrogen connected to any oxygen ion, it will be connected to oxygen atom. Now place pair of electrons in between each atom for bond formation. Now these three oxygen atoms here need six more electrons and this oxygen here which is connected to hydrogen needs four more electrons for complete octet. So let us go ahead and assign electrons to each oxygen atom. Also, HSO4- is an ion, so we'll enclose it within a bracket. Now, each and every atom here has complete outer shell. And let us calculate the formal charge of each atom just to confirm that this is the final Lewis structure of HSO4-. For oxygen, we have 6 valence electrons minus 6 non-bonding electrons minus 2 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of minus 1. For this oxygen which is connected to hydrogen, we have 6 valence electrons minus 4 non-bonding electrons minus 4 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of 0. So let us see for the sulfur atom. We have 6 valence electrons minus 0 non-bonding electrons minus 8 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of plus 2. Now these charges here represent that there is unequal charge distribution between the atoms. Now that results in unstability of the molecule and that is unwanted. And to avoid that, uh, what we will do is we will shift electrons from these two oxygen atoms here to in between oxygen and sulfur. Now that will result in the formation of double bond. Now if we calculate the formal charge, it will be zero for these three oxygen atoms here. Uh, sulfur and hydrogen too will have zero formal charge. But the oxygen atom here has a formal charge of minus one. And we didn't shift the electrons from this oxygen here because if we do that then the overall charge of the ion will be zero. And we know that the sum of formal charge must be equal to the overall charge of the ion. Also here sulfur has more than eight electrons in its outermost shell and that is okay as sulfur can expand its octet and can hold more than eight electrons. So this is the final Lewis structure of hydrogen sulfate. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe our channel and thanks for watching.